Coins and Collectibles here, so today we will be looking at the 1906 Canadian Quarter. So this coin has a mintage of only 1,237,843. The composition of this coin is 0.925 silver and 0.075 copper. It weighs around 5.83 grams and then the portrait on the back is of King Edward. So there are two varieties of this coin. There is the small crown variety, then there's the large crown. The most valuable variety that we will be looking for is the small crown. It's so rare that even a low grade of this coin can get you a couple thousand dollars. So now I'll tell you how to determine what variety you have. On the large crown design, there is a fold in the velvet lining on the right side of the crown. And the large crown is clearly much closer to the leaves on both sides than the small crown. The bar above the date ends in two different locations. So keep comparing your coin to the different varieties on the screen and then you'll be able to tell which variety you have. Hopefully you have the small crown, the rare variety. And so now this is the grading table. Depending on the condition of your coin will determine how much it's worth. High grade examples of the small crown variety can get you up to almost $30,000, while low grade examples of this coin can even get you a couple thousand dollars. If you have the large crown variety, then you can still get some money, not a lot. If you're not sure what grade your coin is, then try matching the condition of your coin with the ones on the screen, then follow the chart with what variety you have, and then you'll be able to tell how much it's worth. So now we'll be looking at some of the small crown varieties that sold for quite a bit of money. So this first one here, this was graded by PCGS and it was almost uncirculated 55, sold for a total of $19,550. Then the next three coins, uh, they were sold off eBay. They were still sold for quite a bit of money. So this first one here, uh, this was graded um, G4 still in pretty bad shape and this sold for a thousand eight hundred dollars this next one it's not graded by any company but uh, since it's a small crown variety it's still sold for six hundred and eighty nine dollars then the last one this one is an absolute horrible condition you can't even barely see the 25 cents on the front of the coin and you can barely even see the date on the back side of the coin you can still make out the portrait of king edward but you can only see a few of the letters on the back but this sold actually for a total of four hundred and thirty six dollars so thanks everyone for watching make sure to like share and subscribe and make sure to turn on your post notifications so that when i make a new video you all can see it right away